remember this day when i was literally very sick and the only thing that i could do was lie on my bed and uh, in order to come out of that weak situation of uh, my time uh, and in also in order to kill my time productively rather than just laying on the bed i decided to pick up one one arranged murder Will you join me for an arranged murder? If your answer is yes, then definitely hook on to this video till the end. And even if your answer is no, please do watch the video till the end. Everybody, welcome to Let's Live Thousand Lives. I am Pavitra, and welcome to my BookTube channel. So, in today's video, I am going to review the book One Arranged Murder by India's most popular author Chetan Bhagat. Now, this review is actually from a beginner's point of view because this is a for the first time that I have read a Chetan Bhagat novel, especially a murder mystery. So, please get on to the video. Chetan Bhagat is one of India's most popular author, columnist and YouTuber. He was regarded as one of the most top 100 most uh, most influential persons by Times magazine and also his first debut novel is 5 point someone. So moving on to the book One Arranged Murder by Chetan Bhagat. It is the second murder mystery novel by Chetan Bhagat. The first one is The Girl in Room Number 105. Now uh, let me tell you one thing that this book can be read as a standalone book itself. The only uh, thing that uh, you know that is common between these two books is the main protagonist that is Keshav and Saurabh. These characters are reoccurring in One Arranged Murder. There is no difference, uh, there is no any kind of uh, co other common activities between these two books. So definitely you can read One Arranged Murder as a standalone book. Now this book was published way back in two, two, 2020 September and uh, if you remember during that time even I was when I bought the book even I was quite apprehensive about whether uh, should I read girl number uh, girl, the girl in room number Z105 and then later should I go for one arranged murder but no nothing like that it can be read as a standalone book now one arranged murder is the second murder mystery novel by Chetan Bhagat sir so as said it was initially published in 2020 and later it became a very 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 hyped up novel so now I'm going to divide this particular book review into two uh, two sections actually. My point of review where it is absolutely my honest take and then comes the critics review as well as writer's thought process. So let me first get into my point of view. Let me be very honest with you people. I bought this book in 2020 but I read this book in April 2020. 2022 uh, as you all know every book has its own destiny the same man every re reader has its own time where she or he actually pick up a book and starts reading it so this is my own very personal experience I remember this day when I was literally very sick and the only thing that I could do was lie on my bed and uh, in order to come out of that weak situation of uh, my time uh, and in also in order to kill my time productively rather than just laying on the bed I decided to pick up one, one arranged murder and within two days my sickness was also really good and I was so interested and so happy that I picked up this book. So for me this book was actually like a lifesaver because uh, during that time when I was really very sick this book actually uh, took me from my sickness to a very happy place. So this is my honest opinion. So now uh, coming to my review, uh, every reader reads, reads a book either for solely entertainment purpose 
or also for the deep analysis for example even i uh, when we get into many books we go for different aspects feminism social racism uh, what is what uh, where the society is being reflected in the book so many things uh, usually if i was uh, a reader like you know at at any other day even i too would have looked into one arranged murder in that point of view but this time what happened was i was sick and the only thing that i wanted to do was to get out of this and just to divert my mind from my sickness uh, to a really to a really imaginary place and that is the reason i loved one arranged murder because from the first page till the last page i i don't remember i have ever put down the book i was so hooked to the plot of this particular book from the first page itself there is this huge uh, there is this kind of interest thus you know uh, interest and intrigueness that goes on throughout the book and i believe that is something that actually made me hooked to this book now uh, let me tell you uh, i am not going to comment upon the language or any other kind of analysis because i have never done that uh, i have never done that for this book as i told you from first page to the last page my only intention was to know who the murderer murderer is and to know how this murder mystery is going to get solved so this was my only intention now uh, that is the reason i thoroughly enjoyed the book so I would definitely 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 ask you people to pick up this book especially if you are beginner because you know this is an absolute beginner friendly book and let me tell you one arranged murder in September 2020 it was a hype even today it is a hype because after uh, I had actually put an Instagram post on about uh, reading this book so after re- after reading that post few of my friends went home and they also read the book they they were so happy that they could actually get back to reading uh, after reading one arranged murder so this is from personal experience that i'm telling that it is an absolutely beginner friendly book so pick up this book if you are a beginner and definitely enjoy this beautiful read so moving back Uh, to the critics point of view as well as authors reading so as i told you i read this book completely for entertainment purpose but uh, i remember going back to many book reviews uh, based on this book in order to know how this book is so here uh, one of the most uh, important factor that everybody criticized as a reader they criticized is the fat shaming now here the character kesha actually fat fat shapes his best friend as well as his fiance prerna for their body okay for their fat body and uh, this is one of the most uh, you know uh, like among all the negative reviews uh, to be very honest the book has more negative reviews than positive reviews so among all the negative reviews this is a most highlighted factor that is fat shaming is exclusively shown in this particular book now there are many different reasons uh, as a reader we can also put forward many re- different reasons for it the first reason is uh, as a reader as well as a person who lives in a society i believe that writing and a book or any other media okay any other print media or social media any other media can create a huge impact on people's uh, notions their ideas their intentions everything so here what happened is many of them many of the readers said that if it is clearly shown that the main hero of the book keshav is actually fat shaming about his uh, on his best friend also he knows that he is fat shaming there is a statement i know that i am going wrong but still he has to be fat shamed so uh, in such a manner when he is doing it is giving an idea to the society <laughs> that fat shaming is okay so this was one of the review the second review was um, why make uh, you know why make a character uh, a hero who has such a flaw also why can't you make so sarab is the fat the fat person over there the healthy one so here uh, why can't you the this was a question that was put forward to the author why can't you make uh, the this fat person the main character of your novel so all these questions and all these reviews have come up for one arranged murder apart from that so this is a most highlighted negative review apart from that i have never felt like there is anything else in order to point out in this book i was 
being literally okay with uh, every every other factor this is the only point uh, that was highly highlighted by all the reviewers now let me bring up bring you out the writer's explanation to this question so uh, in one of chetan bhagat sir's interview i was watching it based on the book one arranged murder he says that he wanted to create create characters that are real okay and that is because in every other movie if you watch also in every other book if you watch uh, if you read you will realize that every hero is portrayed as the good one he he or she does not have any flaw they are perfect they are perfect dad they are perfect son perfect husband or whoever it is you know they are perfectionist in everything whereas so wanted to portray a character that was the character that was real okay real character that had a flaw and his point actually uh, makes a reader think because he says that if he makes a character that is you know that is completely perfect and uh, you know uh, there is no other flaws in him no one will remember that character for so long okay for some time they may honor that character like anything but for uh, apart from that they may not even remember but now keshav is such a flawed character that every other person every other book reviewer book reviewer and book booktuber has literally mentioned and took his name so he wanted to create characters that long last and for that he needed he desperately made those characters great so these are two perspectives you know i actually put this point in order to uh, let you know people about the two perspectives one is a reader's perspective and one is a writer's perspective so in coming to the conclusion i would say that this book is a you know is absolute beginner friendly book uh, i have known many of my friends who returned to read it only because of this book also my dad only reads chetan bhagat books he is the, he is you know he has he has read every other kind of chetan bhagat book so he only reads chetan bhagat books and this book also he read only because it was written by chetan bhagat second uh, i uh, i know one of this booktubers who actually literally did not like chetan bhagat's writing at all but uh, he or she came back again on the same booktube channel and told that i would definitely recommend uh, this particular book one arranged murder because uh, chetan bhagat has literally uh, changed my opinions on his writing so in that manner every reader has his or own personal experience to speak of so amidst all the negative reviews i would say that this is a very positive book to begin with if you are a absolute reader so definitely pick up one arranged murder if you are a beginner i am telling you that you will definitely get back to your reading